Have you ever felt wronged or harmed by someone who seems to act with malice, without any remorse or consequence? In a world where injustices seem to prevail and challenges become increasingly difficult, it's natural to seek spiritual refuge and a divine solution. Today, we bring you a powerful prayer, inspired by the wisdom and protection of Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, two saints known for their ability to offer support and justice against adversities. If you're seeking justice, if you wish for those who have wronged you to face the consequences of their actions without your intervention, this prayer is for you. Join us in the next few minutes to invoke this celestial protection and see your enemy fall into their own trap, through the power of faith and prayer. Accompany this prayer with an open heart and strong faith. Now, in the comments, leave the following phrase, all my enemies will fall into their own trap. Before starting this blessed prayer, I ask you to hit the like button on this video. And also subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell. So you can follow strong and powerful prayers like this one exclusively. Don't forget to leave your prayer requests in the video comments. And share this prayer with all the people you love. Let's begin the prayer. Powerful prayer of Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian for your enemy to fall into their own trap. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. O Divine Protectors, Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, before you, I stand with a heart full of faith and hope, seeking refuge and defense against the adversities and enmities that darken my path. With the strength of your celestial intercession, I invoke your power and your justice so that those who oppose me, driven by envy and resentment, find in their own schemes the mirror of their actions. In this hour of need, I entrust myself to your divine protection, fully trusting that I will be safeguarded from all evil and danger lurking in the shadows. With humility, I ask that the light of your wisdom illuminate my path and reveal the hidden traps my enemies have set for me. May under your powerful advocacy, any spell, curse, or act of witchcraft directed against me or my loved ones be neutralized and returned to its source, allowing truth and justice to prevail over falsehood and wickedness. May through the intervention of Saint Benedict, Abbot of Virtue, and Saint Cyprian, Martyr of the Faith, the shadows seeking to envelop me be dispersed, and all negative force directed towards me vanish into the void. I implore that your celestial shield surround me, forming an impenetrable barrier that no evil can cross. I fervently request that my surroundings be purified, that every corner of my home and every space in my life be cleansed of the presence of all that does not come from the light. May harmony and peace be restored, displacing the discord and unrest fueled by witchcraft and ill intentions. Saint Benedict, known for your protective medal, make its symbol a constant reminder of your presence and your power against the forces of evil. And Saint Cyprian, once a practitioner of dark arts and now a protective saint, use your knowledge turned into divine wisdom to undo the knots of black magic that may try to entangle me. May your joint prayers form a cloak of protection that covers me day and night, warding off evil spirits, envy, and all negativity. In this act of faith, I renew my trust in the power of the Most High, confident that under His supreme command and with your intercession, no evil will disturb my peace or divert my path towards good. Just as I seek protection against the shadows and curses, I also turn to you, Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, to be guarded from poisonous tongues and harmful words that seek to tarnish my reputation and disturb my tranquility. 
May the strength of your intercession silence the rumors and gossip, transforming malice into understanding and envy into fraternity. I implore that the truth shine above whispers and falsehoods, that my name be defended in absence by the integrity of my character and the actions I perform under divine guidance. May those inclined to spread gossip and slander find in their hearts remorse and the will to change, recognizing the pain their words can cause. Let Saint Benedict, the patron of Europe and protector against evil, grant me the serenity to overlook provocations and stand firm in my faith and convictions. And let Saint Cyprian, who turned from darkness to light, Teach me to forgive those who have wronged me, reminding me that even the most astray can find their way back to righteousness. In this plea for protection, I seek not only the quieting of slanderers but also the healing of the divisions that malice may have sown within my community. May harmony be restored, and together, may we build an environment of mutual respect and understanding where communication is always clear and filled with good intent. With these wishes, I place my trust in you, Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, knowing that my request will be heeded. May peace and love triumph over conflict and discord, and may my heart remain pure in the face of trials, strengthened by your grace and divine protection. Continuing my plea, I now extend my request to the dispersion of the envy surrounding my life, a corrosive force seeking to undermine my happiness and achievements. Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, whose light has overcome darkness, I ask you to drive away from me all feelings of envy, both from others and within myself, purifying my surroundings and my being of this spiritual poison. May the presence of your infinite goodness act as a mirror, reflecting towards those who look upon me with envious eyes, not what they lack, but the abundance that is also available to them under divine grace. Transform, dear saints, envy into inspiration, so that instead of wishing harm, those around me are motivated to seek their own path to success and fulfillment. I request that my life be shielded against the harmful effects of envy, that no plan born of this sentiment succeeds in disturbing my peace or that of my loved ones. May Saint Benedict, with his rule of peace and labor, and Saint Cyprian, with his turn towards the light, inspire me to live in such a way that my existence contributes to the common well-being, minimizing opportunities for envy. May every step I take and every success I achieve be seen as testimonies of what can be attained with faith and effort, and not as causes for envy. I pray that my heart remains humble before the gifts received and generous in sharing my blessings, thus creating a virtuous circle of gratitude and abundance. In this prayer, I trust that Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian will guide me through any adversity, protecting me from envy in any other negativity. May their intercession ensure a clear path forward, filled with light, love, and brotherhood, where understanding and mutual appreciation always prevail among all. In this sacred space of prayer, with my heart anchored in the deepest faith, I extend my plea to confront the adversity presented by those who, driven by dark motives, have positioned themselves as enemies on my path. Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, you who have demonstrated throughout the ages your ability to overcome evil with light, I ask you to guide these adversaries towards the traps they have set themselves. May in their attempt to harm, they find a divine lesson of reflection and redemption, experiencing the depth of their mistake and the emptiness of their malicious actions. Allow each obstacle they have placed, every stone they have tried to make me stumble upon, to become the instrument of their own teaching. May falling into the nets they have laid for me, 
their hearts open to the understanding that evil only returns to its place of origin, multiplied in lessons that, I hope, guide them back to the path of good. May this experience not be just a defeat for them, but an opportunity to change, inspired by the mercy that even in their fall, I extend to them. In requesting that their own schemes turn against them, I do not seek vengeance, but rather invoke the divine principle of justice and balance. May this turn of events serve not only as protection for me and mine but as a clear message of the power of divine justice, which does not allow evil to prevail indefinitely. May Saint Benedict, with his wisdom, and Saint Cyprian, with his transformation, witness this act of celestial balance, where those who seek to do harm, find themselves face to face with the consequences of their own actions. Through this process, I also ask for the wisdom to handle these situations with grace and compassion. May my heart remain steadfast in love and faith, not succumbing to the temptation of bitterness or resentment. May I, inspired by your example, Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, offer forgiveness to those who have harmed me, knowing that in their fall and subsequent reflection, there is an opportunity for their redemption. Thus, with these wishes laid before the compassionate gaze of Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, I close my prayer, trusting in their powerful intercession in the perfect plan of the Creator. May every action directed against me be transformed into a life lesson for the emitter, and may the cycle of negativity break under the weight of divine justice. May peace, love, and harmony triumph at the end of this spiritual journey, marking the beginning of a new chapter full of light and hope for all. With my heart brimming with faith and hope, and my eyes lifted to the heavens in a sign of deep gratitude, I bow before the magnificence of your intercession, Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian. My soul, touched by the grace of your protection, is filled with infinite thankfulness. Through the shadows of adversity, your light has been my guide, and in moments of doubt, your power has strengthened my spirit. For having kept me safe under your sacred mantle, for having led my enemies to reflection through their own traps, and for having purified my path of all negativity, I give you thanks. Your presence has been a bastion of strength and an inexhaustible source of hope in my life. As I close this prayer, I do so with the certainty that your benevolent vigilance continues over me and mine. I promise to keep alive the memory of this moment of spiritual communion, carrying in my heart the lesson of your mercy and divine justice. May my life reflect the gratitude I feel towards you, Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, for each day I awaken free from the bonds of evil and for each night I rest in peace, knowing that I am protected. May the echo of my gratitude reach the heavens and join the celestial symphony of praises to your intercession. Blessed be, today and always, for being my guides and protectors on the path to the light. I commit to being a reflection of your teachings, practicing kindness, understanding, and forgiveness at every step of my journey, recognizing in each challenge an opportunity to grow spiritually and come even closer to divinity. May my conduct and my words be a testimony to the unshakable faith I place in your power and love, inspiring others to seek guidance and shelter in your sacred figures. I aspire for my existence to not only be a testimony of your protection but also a channel through which your light can reach those in the shadow, bringing hope and relief to troubled hearts. On this path of light, I commit to being a beacon of your peace, radiating with my actions the serenity and strength you have bestowed upon me. Thus, in unity with your divine will, may my life be an offering of love and eternal gratitude towards you, 
transforming every moment of tribulation into a celebration of faith and resilience. Blessed be Saint Benedict and Saint Cyprian, for interceding before the Most High for me and all those who seek refuge under your sacred mantle. May we, together, in harmony and devotion, continue our path, illuminated by your presence, until we reach spiritual fulfillment and eternal peace. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I have faith that this prayer will help you. Share this prayer so that it can help more and more people. If you liked it, please visit our channel and watch more videos like this. Don't forget to leave a like on the video, as it tells YouTube that this kind of content is important to you and helps us bring more prayers like this. Also, subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell so that YouTube can send you new videos firsthand. And don't forget to leave your prayers and requests in the video comments. Here are two more powerful videos like this to bless you.